Now, Maldives Defense Minister has acknowledged that the island nation's military still does not have pilots capable of operating two helicopters and a Donier aircraft that was donated by India. And this announcement comes days after 76 Indian defense personnel left Mali at the instance of recently elected President Mohamed Moizu. Now, these remarks were made at a press conference while responding to a journalist. He was briefing the media about the withdrawal of Indian soldiers stationed in the Maldives to operate three aircraft. And their replacements in New Delhi had provided the Donia aircraft to the Maldives to help the island nation enhance surveillance over its exclusive economic zone as well as to keep an eye on seabone terrorists. Now the ties between the two countries took a downturn after Moizu, a pro-China leader, insisted on the withdrawal of all Indian military personnel operating the three aviation platforms in the island nation by May 10th. India has already withdrawn 76 military personnel. Interestingly, the current administration criticized the previous government and claimed that there were capable pilots in the MNDF to fly these donated aircraft. Now, training Maldivians was the main reason for the arrival of Indian soldiers. The helicopters were donated during former presidents Mohammed Nasheed and Abdullah Yamin's governments. Meanwhile, the Donia aircraft was brought during former President Ibrahim Mohamed Soli's government despite the failure to complete the training to date. Foreign Minister Zamir said that the agreement to replace the Indian soldiers with civilians also includes provisions for training local pilots. All right, for more on this, we're now being joined by Principal Diplomatic Correspondent Sidhan Sibbal. Uh, Sidhan, thank you so much for joining us. To begin with, how important are these two helicopters in the Donia aircraft to the Maldives that New Delhi has donated? Well, these are important since uh, they are used for humanitarian purposes. Now, the comments, of course, uh, shows that still training is required by Maldivian authorities, the uh, pilots, uh, for operation of these uh, humanitarian assets which India has given. Now, essentially, we know the controversy that uh, Maldives president who came on... Um, and the India plan said that he would like to remove all the Indian military personnel. It has happened last week and it has been replaced by civilian personnel, Indian civilian personnel. But still, Maldive, Maldivians don't have the capability and for that, the training is underway. Right. Thank you, Siddhant, uh, for joining us on the show and getting us all the latest on that.